Hello everybody and welcome back. My name is Digi and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the Plunger Man Morph, also known as the Teamwork Badge. But before we keep going, shout out of the day goes to Funny Boy User. Thank you for being first, at commenting first. Alright, so the Plunger Cameraman Teamwork Badge. No! Ah, no! <laughs> Anyways, this badge requires two people. That's right, before you are able to do it solo, now you need to have a second person, a friend, a stranger in this server. But before you can even get started, make sure you activate your quest. It should have a start button. Once you click it, it should then show up here on your right. Mine says find plunger man. However, we've got to do something before we even find the plunger man. So I'm going to go ahead and go and morph into the speaker heli. And then we're going to go and get what we need right here in spawn if you're looking at it this way we're gonna go over this side right here down this road go forward all the way then go to your right you will see that bridge but we're gonna go into this alleyway so make sure to morph into a small character so you can fit your thickness in here then you're gonna go to your right you might remember this pathway this was to the scientist and the computer that has probably the hardest code ever in my life. Go down here to your left, you might recognize it, but we don't have to do any of that stuff. Look to your right, and you're gonna see a code here, four digits. Mine is gonna be 7711. Now this code will be different for every server. Your code will be different than my code. Yours might be 1234, and then the other person in another server might be 4321. So, do not copy this code. It will not be the same. Just come here, find it, and now what we're going to do is take that code to another place. Now, remember, you need two people. Don't worry though, the code works for both people. This code is for everybody in the server, okay? So, everyone in the server will have the same code. Now, going on this way, you might remember this place. This is a lot of badges out, or a lot of quests out here. But you're gonna go up this um, hill. I'm just gonna say ramp, but hill. And then you also might remember this alleyway to our right to get the Titan Speaker Man core. That's right. We're actually going to that same spot right now. So go down this alleyway. Once you get to this ledge, you're gonna just hop on off. Trust me, don't worry. There is a ground there turn around go down this corridor and then your friend and you can meet each other there <laughs> there we go <laughs> now you both have to stand here so I'm gonna go ahead and enter the code for my side so that's gonna be 7711 and then click enter then that means you have confirmed it then your friends gonna walk over there and then put in their code gotta wait for them and put code Come on, 7711, and then click enter. There we go. Now we both should be teleported to the puzzles. That's right. It's kind of like Portal. So first part is the biometrics. Go ahead and do it. And what you have to do is memorize this shape and then re, I guess, put it back in. So you're clicking like that. You're just recreating it. Okay, ooh, this one's a little tricky. All right, there we are. Boom. And then, oh, this kind of looks like a horsey. <laughs> kind of looks like a horsey. There we go. So I completed my part. Now, Kevin has to complete their part. But while they do that, shared file or fails. You guys have a total of 10 fails together. Okay, so you don't have 10 and they don't have 10. You have 10 fails. And if you reach that 10, you guys start all over. All right, Kevin has completed his puzzle. Then we're gonna move on to the next puzzle. There's only two puzzles. This one over here, bypass barrier. What you gotta do is click the numbers in order. So one, two, three, boom. However, once you click on the first number, they will disappear. So memorize where the numbers are. So one, two, three, four, boom. This one's a little trickier. So one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, boom. Then one, two, three, okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, boom. I've completed my side. Now I gotta wait for Kevin. 
There we go. And once Kevin completed it, we will get the teamwork badge. However, you have to make sure you talk to the plunger cameraman. Go ahead and interact with him. Hmm, how can I harness the power of this Titan core? I must become stronger. And then it will give you the badge or the quest, which will then give you the morph. Just question mark, question mark. But there you go. That is how you complete this quest and how you obtain the teamwork badge. Now, if you want to go ahead and check out the badge morph or the quest morph, go ahead and just teleport back to the hub. And it will bring your friend also with you. So make sure they are ready to leave. But let's go ahead and check out the, where are you? There he is, Plunger Cameraman. Ooh. Okay, okay, okay. Can I use the plungers? A punch? I can't use the plungers? What? What's the point of being Plunger Man then if I can't use my plungers? I really want to plunge the toilet, so. Very well, though. But that is it, everyone. If you enjoyed, though, leave a like, subscribe down below, and join the badge hunting squad today. Use star code DIGI whenever you buy Robux or Premium. And as always, stay awesome, stay cool, and good luck badge hunting. Bye-bye.